What is going on fellow fishing adventures? Today we're out at the beautiful Guadalupe River in South Texas and today we're going to be doing some fishing, some creek fishing with some ultralights and as you all see later in the video I actually ended up, you know, my target was to catch some little bass, some little bluegill and ultralights and we did that. I also ended up catching some really nice bass and some really nice catfish. It was a total shock so make sure you'll stay tuned for that. It was a really fun day out here and I'm actually doing something I've never done on my channel before which is fishing out of my Cabela's inner tube. Y'all will kind of see what that is throughout the video. It's kind of like this inflatable fishing tube raft thing. Let's get in to the fishing adventure. a Guadalupe bass, I believe. Possibly spotted, definitely not a largie. Let's go. First fish of the day, nice little spotted or Guadalupe bass. I'm not quite sure, leave a comment down below. Let's get a release on him. I didn't even know I had him. I set the hook right when it landed. I thought it was hung and he was just on, like that. Other bass. They're touching the bank. I think it's hollow or something. <laughs> Two casts in a row, little bass. Got him. Got him. It's another bass. It's another. Gosh darn. Oh! Oh, he's right there. Got him. Bloogie. Beautiful little sunfish right there. Oh, 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 he's in the water. <laughs> yeah. Got him. Oh my god, Dad. That was quick, dude. That was a good one. That was one cast. It's a big boy. right there. Maddox wants to get the release. Beautiful little sunfish right here. Jackson wants to try and release it. Oh, there we go, buddy. Now we're gonna let it go. <laughs> I actually I'm not kidding I swear so oh I got a big one another little spot yeah we caught about 10 or 15 yeah a little there were um, all little spot of bass and bluegill yeah just a little crappie jig with a little crappie max little frog looking lure they seem to really like it
first cast with the shiners, you guys, he came up and hit it on the surface. That is a nice spotted bass, it appears like. Let's go. First cast with the live shiner that we caught. I just got hit. I got one. <laughs> you guys, live shiners was the key right here. I mean, we're still catching them artificial. My dad's fishing with artificial. He keeps getting hit. Man, they are blowing up these shiners. Another little bass. Get you back. Got it. Oh, that was crazy. I watched him chase it. He's gonna hit it. He's got it. He got it. We got him. Oh, that was crazy. That's the biggest one I've caught today. You guys, that was crazy. I hope the GoPro caught that. That's the craziest eat I've ever seen a bass make. Oh, yes. Nice little guad. There, I'm telling y'all, if you can't catch fish on our officials, try and catch live bait where you're fishing from. The body of water that you're gonna fish, if you can get live bait from that body, same body of water, you're gonna have some good luck. So whenever I'm fishing with live shiners like this, you can fish them on pretty much any combo, but I like to fish it on a light action ultralight. Both the rods we are fishing with today are light action spinning rods. You can get really into detail with like, you know, fast action, medium action, all that kind of stuff. If they're an ultralight, I like them. Um, got a really small hook. I have a braid to a clear 12 pound mono leader. It's a small hook. And I'm casting sidearm when what casting sidearm means is there's overhead, which is when you cast like this. But, and that's okay in some scenarios, like if you have a, you know, if there's trees here and trees here and you got to cast down the middle, you can go overhead. But if we're trying to be sneaky like we are on these fish, I cast them out there sidearm like that. So sidearm is when you kind of pitch them sideways and it just makes everything look much more natural. It lands the bait much softer into the water. It just, it works well. Oh, oh, there's another bass just go, going by right here. Another bass. Where'd he go? There's another, oh, 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 oh. Bass got him, bass got him. No, he took him. Got a shiner rigged up. Let's go ahead, pitch him out here into this deep pocket. Oh my gosh, no way, no way. It's a catfish, it's a catfish, you guys. You guys, little channel cat. We were actually thinking about taking this guy home for my ponds, but I just don't think he would survive and I don't wanna, I don't wanna swim up, there he goes. That was such a surprise catch. Let's get right back out there. 